How's it going everyone? It's Gadgets Boy and in this video we'll be taking a look at Lytro. So this camera uh, allows you to take your photo first and then process it later in terms of refocusing it and doing things like change your perspective. Uh, you can also do manual things now like change, uh, control the ND filter, lock exposure, change your shutter speed and the ISO as well. And you can also add something they call live filters uh, on the via the app on the iPhone or use the actual software that comes with it. So. Let's take a look at this and see what it's about. So this has eight times optical zoom and has a constant f2 aperture. So uh, this allows you to get that really shallow depth of field so you can refocus later and things like that. Here's the camera itself. We'll take a closer look again just in a second. I'll just put that to the side for a second. Uh, we'll see what else is inside uh, of the packaging here. So underneath here, we get a little pack which contains accessories and uh, manuals and things like that. So let's take that out. So you get uh, a cleaning cloth there, so you can keep it clean and wipe any fingerprints and stuff like that off. Uh, you've got a lanyard or wrist strap here, so you can uh, sort of keep it secure on your wrist while you're out and about taking photos. And you've also got your USB cable here. So this is a micro USB cable to a full USB, so you can use this to transfer data to your software for uh, refocusing and changing perspective uh, as such. So you see what else is here. So you've got your uh, manual, so it gives you some this card here tells you to go on their website to check out the tips available on how to use it. Uh, you got your warranty card information and you also got your magnetic uh, lens cap here. So that goes uh, on the front when you aren't using it. So when you're not using it, you can just place that on the front uh, and that keeps it secure in terms of keeping the lens uh, clean, free from dust and so on. So we'll put that to the side and take a closer look at this. So here's the camera itself, as you can see there, so it's got this aluminium body right at the front there. It looks different as well, it doesn't look like your normal camera or digital point to shoot camera or DSLRs out there. You got your shutter button there and just right there you won't be able to see it, but it's got a capacitive touch area there. If you rub your finger on it, you can actually feel it there and that allows you to do your eight times optical zoom by going left to right. Uh, as you wish. On the back there, you've got your touch screen there. Little small touch screen, but it does the job to quickly see what you've taken before you go back to the computer and do your post processing. Uh, that's, that's where your wrist strap would go. So you feed that through there and keep it on your wrist. And on the bottom, there's your power button and your USB port. So again, this is where you'd use it uh, to charge it as well as transfer data as well. So we just put that back into place and that's it. So this silicon here uh, allows it for perfect grip so when you're taking photos you get a nice grip on the camera itself to take your photos and let's, let's take a look at the lens itself so you can see there's got Lytro logo there and you can see your big uh, lens right in front of it so that's all it is about this really nice and simple uh, so you can push boundaries in terms of taking photos and then refocusing uh, later uh, let's just power that on as well so you can see the interface there so you can just put your finger on top there and you can see that the zoom uh, will change let's just have a look at the uh, lens there moving as we change the zoom there. Pretty cool, right? So that's touchscreen as well, so you can go up and down. That gives you some extra options and settings. Uh, you can go left to right, so you can have a look at the pictures that you've taken already. And that's all it is. Nice and simple, straightforward. Uh, there's nothing that you need to really start learning and stuff like that. So you can just get this and start shooting and taking photos straight away. So that's the shutter button at the front there. You just press that and it's pretty quick because there's not a lot to do in that process. So that's a sample photo there. There's a little process in there and then you can start to uh, tap around the screen to refocus to where you'd like to focus or change perspective. Obviously, I haven't taken a good photo there to do that with. Uh, this will set you back uh, $499 if you want the 16 gig version uh, or if you want the 8 gig version, you can pick it, up, pick it up for $399 from Lytro's website. Link will be in the description area. It's also available in five colors. So if you prefer a different color, you can always buy it in a different color as well. Anyway, guys, do let me know what you think in the comment area below. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up as well and make sure you subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And if I don't put a video out before Christmas, then guys, have a good Christmas and uh, catch you guys later. Bye.